This is my reaction to Yu-Gi-Oh! Season 1, Episode 16, The Scars of Defeat. In the last episode, Yugi beat Panic after intimidating him and then sent him away to... Uh... The graveyard or something? I don't know. He sent him away magically with his millennial puzzle, which is nice. And then returned Mai's star pieces, which is also good, so she's still in the competition, which I, I love. Also, if you like full reactions to Yu-Gi-Oh! with other shows that I react, you can join my patrons from the link down below. So, yeah, let's go. As for you, Kaiba, our partnership is just beginning. <laughs> oh. I can't believe all my business associates would turn on me after a single defeat. Yeah. Then again, losing to Yugi has shaken my self-confidence too. Not when Pegasus has kidnapped my little brother Mokuba. Mm. No, if I'm gonna face off against Pegasus, I have to rely on my old dueling instincts. That's the only chance I have of freeing Mokuba. Oh. Am I seeing things, or is your Millennium Ring actually glowing? If it's not, then we're both hallucinating. Oh. That's kind of spooky. It's pointing you? somewhere, I think. The way it's pointing like that? Yes. It's almost like it's being tugged toward the castle. Pegasus's castle? Why would it do that? I don't know, but it did the same thing the day I met you. Oh. I had just been transferred into your school. Everyone, please welcome your new classmate, Bakura. Wham! Try defending this, you! I was watching you guys play duel monsters when suddenly my ring started to glow and pointed right towards your millennium puzzle. So it's like a compass almost for the other millennial wow, puzzles. Pieces. Those pointers are somehow able to zone in on other millennium items. But then why would it point to the castle? Because of what's inside the castle. Pegasus's millennium eye. That's yeah. what my grandpa's soul. You'll be compensated for all of your trouble. Huh? Actually, Kaiba, I was thinking that since we're all headed for Pegasus's castle, you could stick with us. Of course, <laughs> you'll need some star chips. Don't be so naive. This isn't just a game for me, Yugi. Yeah. I'm going after Pegasus to save my brother. Not so I can win some silly prize. Have fun with your tournament. But, Kaiba, that snobby little... I mean, he's not wrong. Hey. Listen, tough guy, I can understand you wanting to get your little brother back. Yeah. Here, but don't go thinking that you're the only one here with a noble call. That's right, hotshot. I ain't scared of you. Nice grip. Let me show you mine. Oh. Oh, that was uncalled for. Joey. Joey, can you hear me? Are you all right? Oh. Check his pulse, Yugi. He's fine. He just gripped his arm a little bit. I'm gonna let you in. Always being really brave or nuts. He's nuts. Forget it. Why don't you go look for an opponent you can actually beat, like an infant or a monkey? Damn. What'd you say? That monkey thing gets him every time. Yeah. Not anymore. That's right, tough guy. I bet ever since Yugi mopped the floor with you, you can't even lay a trap card without flinching. Okay, Joey, let it go. This is really Joey, you need to calm the fuck down. Way. What do you say, money bags? Care to prove me wrong? On one condition. Huh? Whoa, check out all those lights. It's like raining glitter. Yeah, it's like something from an enchanted dream. Oh. You're a nightmare. Whoa. No way. That's a hologram? A hologram of unprecedented realism. It breathes. It snarls. My new dueling disc technology even simulates its odor. That's actually really cool. That thing really Yes! He would stood your attack! Oh, did he? Look again. Oh, no, he cut his neck open. Okay. That's real enough for me. I can't believe it! That ugly overgrown ox! He cut my lizard in half! Yeah, he does. Flaming sword of battle! But Joey! The battle ox is resistant to all fire type creatures! <laughs> now he tells me. Um, Why am I not surprised that you'd make such an absolute yeah. mistake? Maybe from now on you ought to let Yugi pick all of your moves for you. Or oh. yet, why don't I teach you some of the advanced moves of the game the hard way? Ooh, please do. Mystic Horseman and Battle Ox. Merge into Rapid Horseman. Oh.
Oh my god. You think I'm afraid of that deformed pony? I'll show you something that you should be afraid of. Swamp battle guard attack! Damn. X Raider, avenge my battle guard! Joey sucks. Go battle steer! Yep. That's right, Joey. Fall to the dirt like a whimpering dog. Oh! It took Exodia for even Yugi to beat this guy. I need true the round may be yours, but the duel is about to become mine. Yeah. Say what? Your red eyes is a powerful dragon, but his ferocity pales in comparison to my beast. <gasps> yep. The legendary blue eyes white dragon. Blue eyes white dragon. White lightning attack now. Damn, and there goes his red eyes. No, yeah. I lost. Are we shocked? No. That's right, Joey. Cap is amazing. Stay down. Joey was just starting to believe in himself as a duelist. That's right. Beating him doesn't give you the right to communicate. Okay, well, Joey was the one who challenged him first. Let's not forget that. Look, kid, do you honestly believe that if you were dueling Pegasus, he would have been any more merciful with you than I was? Yeah. I understand that the heart of the cards is a powerful philosophy, and that it all works well for you, but I need to duel my own way now. I can't risk trying something new, and maybe Joey shouldn't either, unless he likes life as a dog, scrounging on the scraps of Pegasus <laughs> begging for mercy from true duelists. Hey, what are you doing? Asking for help's illegal! I don't need help. A child could defeat you, Bandit Keith, and I'm going to prove it. Damn. I just started to learn how to play last week. Just follow these instructions and you'll win. No way! Uh, I think I just took all your life points. <laughs> what? You little snot-nosed brat, there is no way you could have known I was going to play that card. Give me that. Huh? Uh, it's all here. The card I play, how to beat it, everything. Huh? Sam is the winner. Oh. Damn. I still don't know how he did it. It's the millennial eye it makes him see the like foresight of the edge I need to beat him once and for all. But Kaiba, that's still no excuse to take it out on us and turn Joey into your new system's guinea pig. Joey battles wanted to battle him himself. The only way to beat Pegasus, so I had to test it. This is war for me, Yugi. Your friend was a casualty. Yeah. Kaiba, we may not agree with each other's methods, but at least we both understand that Pegasus must be stopped. I hope you succeed in rescuing your brother, and I hope you succeed in your ventures. Let's just hope our paths don't cross again before this is all over. Oh. <laughs> I can sense you, Kaiba. <laughs> but are you hunting for me? Or am I hunting you? Oh, no. <laughs> that my reaction to Yu-Gi-Oh! Season 1, Episode 16, The Scars of Defeat. So Kaiba had arrived at the island and met with Yu-Gi and friends, and he kind of... Told him all to fuck off, and he's gonna do his own thing to save his brother and company and everything. But Joey and his big mouth were like, no, you can't do that, I'm gonna challenge you. And he's like, okay, bet. And then completely destroyed him and obliterated him in every way, shape, and form. So now Kaiba's off to find Pegasus himself, which honestly, he should like it. I actually really like Kaiba. I think Kaiba and Mai are my two favorites. Um, so I don't know what this is about me, because they're both, or at least seen as antagonists at some point. So, but yeah, it also seems like Pegasus knows Cap is here and is, I guess, waiting for him to show up, which is not, not good. So, yeah, that's it.